and welcome to Sask Guru. As we approach the end of 2023, it is the perfect time to recap some of the bigger Salesforce news, innovations and features that mark the calendar this year. Salesforce began 2023 by unveiling new automotive cloud and cloud commerce solutions at the Consumer Electronics Show CES in Las Vegas. With the latest cloud solutions, automakers can deliver distinctive and personalized experiences spanning the entire business journey from car buying to driving and servicing from a single unified platform. In January, Salesforce announced the Spring 23 product release preview was live. The Spring 23 product release included hundreds of new features including WhatsApp business messaging, direct integration, Salesforce contact center insights and scheduling, quick promotion setup and service process automation and others. Salesforce introduced new fields for gender identity and pronoun data in February to create a more inclusive environment throughout its product line. The new OTP in enhancements not only allow customers to represent transgender and non-binary people better, but also help make gender-related data more accurate. Salesforce had a busy day at its annual Trailblazers DX Developer Conference in March. The enterprise software maker unveiled Einstein GPT, a generative AI pilot that brings chat GPT-like features to the broader Salesforce platform. They also partnered with OpenAI to introduce the ChatGPT app for Slack. In beta, at the time of the announcement, Slack GPT will allow features such as conversation summaries and writing assistance within the enterprise communications app. Product news was one of the many focuses during Trailblazers DX. Salesforce also announced a $250 million investments fund specifically targeted at responsible generative AI. The fund is being run by its VC arm, Salesforce Ventures, which it said had already invested in four AI startups. Salesforce also showcased the newest addition to its family of characters, Flo the Flying Squirrel. According to a company report, Flo is the new mascot for Flo Builder and like Salesforce Flo, is agile, hardworking and ready to help your team reach new heights. In April, Salesforce began rolling out Slack Canvas to all Slack users. First introduced at Dreamforce 2022, the Canvas features allows teams to capture, organize and share information from different sources inside Slack. Since March of this year, Salesforce has steadily begun integrating the power of generative AI into its platform, consolidating them under the umbrella brand of Einstein GPT. This generative AI CRM technology was initially featured in the sales, service and marketing sectors. Following this, in May of this year, Slack GPT and Tableau GPT were also integrated. With the latest additions of Marketing GPT and Commerce GPT tailored, benefits are offered to marketers, mechanizers and costumers respectively. In other news, Salesforce inaugurated its new offices in Dublin, Ireland on 4th May. The company's report highlights that the Salesforce Tower Dublin is the largest office in the EMEA region. Notably, it is one of the most sustainable buildings in Ireland, boasting double LEED platinum certification and powered entirely by renewable energy aided by rooftop solar panels. Emphasizing Salesforce's focus on trusted AI and security, CEO Mark Benioff announced the AI cloud service during the AI Day event on June 12th. This comprehensive solution is designed to provide businesses with dependable and open generative experiences throughout various applications and workflows. A key feature is the Einstein Trust layer, which prioritizes safeguarding sensitive customer data. In July, Salesforce announced a 9% price increase for certain cloud and marketing tools starting in August 2023. While this news boosted the company's stock by about 4%, it raised customer concerns. However, this price adjustment will mainly affect new and existing customers buying new cloud services from August. This marks the company's first price increase in seven years 
during which they introduced new features like generative AI innovations. In August, Salesforce introduced the Salesforce Starter Suite, an enhanced set of tools for small businesses. This comprehensive package integrates key features from Salesforce's sales, marketing, and service portfolios into a unified suite featuring a user-friendly interface. Priced at $25 per user per month, it includes 2,000 outbound emails monthly and a 30-day trial period, making it a potentially attractive option for the SMB segment. Salesforce's generated AI snapshot research, titled the AI Divide, reveal that a specific generation is fully leveraging the capabilities of their generative AI technology. The study released in September indicates that only 49% of the respondents have utilized generative AI and a third use it daily. The research also uncovered that 64% of participants have never used the technology, experiencing a greater inclination to do so if enhanced safety and security measures were in place. And Dreamforce, Salesforce emphasized its commitment to enhancing data, AI, CRM, and trust within its ecosystem. The three-day event featured keynotes and the introduction of innovations such as the Einstein One platform alongside Einstein Copilot and Copilot Studio. The Slack platform underwent a notable AI upgrade by introducing features like Automate with Slack AI platform, Summarize with Slack Assistant, track work using Slack list and update Salesforce data via Sales Elevate. Following two days of notable product releases, Salesforce hosted the highly anticipated Dreamfest concert headlined by the Foo Fighters. A recent IDC study predicts exciting growth for the Salesforce ecosystem, estimating potential revenue surpassing $2 trillion and creating 11.6 million jobs between 2022 and 2028. The study emphasizes the impact of generative AI on the global economy while identifying challenges like skill gaps, AI governance, trust issues, and AI adoption. In October, Salesforce signed a definitive agreement to acquire Admit.ai, a low-code platform that helps create customer service applications. While the deal's terms were not disclosed, Salesforce confirmed that AdKit.ai would be integrated into its service cloud platform and led by Adam Evans, co-founder and CTO of AdKit.ai. October was a standout month as well, as Salesforce secured top spots in key industry rankings. First, its cloud marketplace AppExchange earned leadership status in Forrester's Wave SaaS Marketplace Q4 2023 report. Following this, for a remarkable sixth consecutive year, the tech giant was recognized as a leader in the Gartner Magic Quadrant for B2B marketing automation platforms. Rounding out its accolades, Salesforce clinched the top spot in Gartner's 2023 Magic Quadrant for the enterprise low phone application platforms. LCAP. These accolades showcase Salesforce's commitment to innovation and leadership across diverse tech domains. Salesforce's 2023 holiday season predictions spotlight the transformative impact of social media advertising and generative AI on online sales. The Salesforce Shopping Index forecast unveils a robust 6% year-on-year uptick in global Cyber Week sales with US online sales notching a commandable 5% growth. Black Friday emerged as the pinnacle of the US online shopping, ranking in a staggering $16.4 billion domestically and soaring to $70.9 billion globally. A standard contributor, AI, substantially fueled this surge, propelling a remarkable $51 billion in online sales during the accelerating Cyber Week spree. Following a year-long wait, Salesforce rolled out its highly anticipated Core Builder tool for all users. According to a company report, this innovative platform provides a browser-based coding experience infused with AI capabilities that effortlessly convert natural language into functional code. Additionally, the Web IDE boasts seamless integration with Salesforce extensions and offers a diverse suite of developer tools from the OpenBSX marketplace. 
Salesforce and Amazon Web Services announced a significant AI-focused expansion. The new expansion unveiled at the AWS reInvent 2023 intends to broaden product integrations across data and AI. It also offers select Salesforce products on the AWS marketplace for the first time. According to companies, this development will streamline processes for customers, making it easier to manage their data across both platforms. During its World Tour event in New York this December, Salesforce unveiled a series of strategic enhancements and partnerships. The tech giant expanded its collaboration with Apple, integrating Apple innovations into service cloud and the field service offerings. Additionally, Salesforce introduced data cloud integrations with LinkedIn and Google, bolstering its ecosystem's capabilities. Noteworthy updates on the Einstein One platform were also showcased, featuring the Data Cloud Vector database and the innovative Einstein Copilot search features. Furthermore, Salesforce rolled out the Unlimited Edition Plus, a comprehensive package that amalgamates data, artificial intelligence, and CRM functionalities, presenting users with simplified pricing and packaging options. In a groundbreaking move, Salesforce launched Trailblazer Career Marketplace, a new talent hub to drive connections between employers and trailblazers. Building on the success of Trailhead, the company's acclaimed online learning platform. The new talent hub will act as a centralized destination, allowing job seekers to showcase credentials and connect with potential employers in the Salesforce ecosystem. That's all the wrap. If you enjoyed this roundup, give us a thumbs up and hit that subscription button for more insights. For in-depth insights into these stories and beyond, check out our SAS Guru's blog space at sasguru.co slash blog. We wish you a joyous new year from us at SAS Guru.